Terracore Tribe. My name is Allison, and I'll be your trainer taking you through a 30-minute intermediate hit session. For this routine, it's going to contain four blocks of three exercises each. We'll do each one for 40 seconds with a short 20-second break in between exercises and a full one-minute break between blocks. We'll repeat this two times. So grab your Terracore and let's get started. Here are your exercises for the first block. Kicking it off are V-steps, and right away you're going to feel that dynamic surface, so watch your balance, keep your core engaged. Again, it's lift, lift, down, down. If you'd like to bring this up a notch, we're going to do a wide jump on top. So landing with soft feet, soft knees, jump up, stick the landing, step down, jump up, and then down. For the second exercise in block one, we're doing step kick lunges. So starting with one side, you're gonna step, foot in the center of that dome, kick, reverse lunge, back on the floor. So it's step, kick, lunge, back. Step, kick, lunge. We'll do the one side the first set, and then the other side on the second set. For the third exercise, we're gonna take it down and do push-ups with alternating knees in and out. So hands on top of the dome, wrists are in a nice neutral position. You're going into a high plank, do one toe or knee push-up, hold the plank, drive the knee to the chest, other knee, and then repeat again. So again, if you're um, modifying this, take it to your knees, come back on your toes, and do those knees in and out. Let's get ready for those V-steps. Remember, you have the option you can step up, or you can jump up, landing with soft feet, soft knees. Watch your step, because again, the dynamic surface is gonna throw your balance off, so engage the core. Okay, get ready. 40 seconds in three, two, one. I'm gonna start low and work up. Here's a V-step, up, up, down, down. Arms are optional. Second option, jump up. Soft feet, soft knees. Another challenge, can you stick that landing? And with control, step down. Up and down. What's great about the Terracore is your feet are landing in a neutral positioning. Soft knees, so there's less impact as well when you jump on top of the dome. Whew. And if you're doing your V-steps, go ahead and switch leads and leave with the other leg. You can also mix these up if, mix these up if you like. It's up to you. Three, two, one, and stop. Good. Coming up, step kick lunges. Choose a side to start with, and then the second set, we'll get the other side. Foot landing in the dome, we step kick, reverse lunge back on the floor. All right, take a deep breath. Getting ready. Three, two, one, let's start. Step kick, lunge back. Take your time with this one, no jumping. Core's engaged, and just like before, watch the balance. You're on top of that dome. Foot is in a neutral position, standing tall. So you're burning a lot more calories doing it this way than if you're on a flat bench. Whew. Good. Keep it up. And this knee's not passing the toe. You got it. Almost there at this side. Breathe. You're doing great. Three, two, one, and stop. Walk it out for a moment, because we're taking it down for those push-ups. Remember, one push-up, alternate knee in and out. Option, you can be on your knees for the push-up instead. All right, so take a breath. Let's get into position. Hands in a neutral position, fingers spread. Three, two, one, push-up. Pull the plank, knee in, knee in, again. Core is engaged, making sure the lower back's not caving in or if hips are too high. And you're lowering that chest all the way to on top of the dome. Elbows coming out a little bit and breathe. You know your modification is to drop down to the knees for those push-ups. Come on, keep it up. You get a one minute break after this. Stay with it. You're doing so good. Come on, strong all the way to the end. Three, two, one, and stop. Nice work. One minute break, grab a drink. All right, welcome back. We're on a set number two of block one. Kicking it off are those V-steps. Again, stepping up or jumping up, landing with soft feet, soft knees, watching your balance. All right, take a few seconds, catch your breath, walk it out and march in three, two, one. I'll start low and build up. There's your V-steps. Good, standing nice and tall, big arms. Second option, jump, stick the landing, jump. Stick the landing. Woo. Up 
and down. Good. Not everyone has to be perfect. Do the best you can. You can also even stagger this a little bit. If it's too much for the jump, breathe. You're doing great. Again, land right in the center of that dome. Up and down. You're almost there. Whew. Three, two, one, and stop. Keep it moving in between. March it out. Number two is gonna be a step kick lunge. Other foot, other leg. Step kick, lunge back. So, inside foot lands right in the center of that dome. Watch your balance, focus on the strength. Three, two, one, let's go. Step kick, lunge. Step kick, lunge back, good. Standing tall, push to that heel on the kick. Good, watch your balance. Breathe. You're doing so good. We're rolling through this first block. Almost there. Keep the abs tight, stand tall. Awesome. Stay over there, stay there. Finish this. Woo. Good job. Three, two, one, and stop. Again, keep it moving. Third and final exercise in block one, push-ups with those alternating knees in and out. So hands, shoulder width apart, wrists in a neutral position. Go ahead and zoom that high plank position. Take a breath in and out. Three, two, one, let's go. Push-up, knee-knee. You know your modification. You're doing a knee push-up if you need to instead of on the toes. And then coming back on the toes for the knee drives. Yes, core is engaged, shoulder blades pulled back. Good, squeeze those glutes, Woo. in and out. Yes, come on, almost there. Get a one minute break until block number two after this. Come on, work for it. Nice, this is it, this is it. Breathe, three, two, one. And stop, awesome job, grab a drink. Kicking off block number two, we're starting off with staggered squats with a knee crunch. So starting on one side of your terracore, we'll get the first set to one side, and then the second set will do the other side. Inside foot on top of the terracore, toes point, pointing forward. As you're tight, we're sticking down for a squat, coming up, knee drive, twist over. Down, knee and twist. Keeping the core engaged and the back straight. For the second exercise, we're doing donkey jumps up and over. And for this, we're gonna have our hands on top of the terracore. Again, have your hands um, cupped right around so it's comfortable. Engage the core, and we're jumping over the top, over the top, keeping the knees soft. If you need to modify, modify this. Add a stagger jump instead. For the third exercise, we're doing a set of reverse crunches. Taking a seat on the terracore, you're gonna lean back and either grab the platform or place your hands around the dome. All right, with the knees together, tummy tight. We're crunching the knees all the way up and then bring it down. Exhale, inhale. Modify this with alternating knees in and out. Okay, choose a side to begin with for the squats with the knee lifts. Inside foot's gonna go on top of the terracor, toes facing forward, feet are shoulder width apart, the other one's on the floor. Remember, sink those hips low when you do the squat and then you're driving that outside knee up towards the chest. Ready, set, let's go. Squat, knee. Squat, knee. Keeping that knee on the leg that's on the terracore soft, and then landing with soft feet on the outside foot. Good. The twist is optional. If you're not feeling the twist, you can definitely just pull straight up or modify even more with just a basic squat up and down. Do what's best for you. Do what's challenging. Doing it on the terracore is definitely going to get that heart rate up. Test your balance, test your strength. Breathe. Whew. Keep it up, keep it up. You're almost done. 40 seconds in three, two, one, and stop. Very good, walk it out. Those donkey jumps are coming over. Hands will be on top of the terracore, wrist in a neutral position. You're either jumping over the top or you're doing staggered hops. Okay, so get in position. Make sure the wrists are nice neutral. Okay, ready? Three, two, one, let's go. So take your time with this. If you're not feeling that full jump, 
There's your staggered option. Again, staying light on the feet and breathe. Got it. Keep it up all the way to the end. Take breaks as you need to. Whew. You got it, you got it. And engage that core. Still working on balance here with that unsteady surface. A few more seconds. Whew. Three, two, one, and stop. Whew. Walk it out. Coming up, we're taking it down, reverse curls. So with this one, take a seat on top of the terracore. Make sure you feel supported. Reach back for either the platform or the dome. Ready? Let's go. Crunch in and out. Take these slow. You know you can modify. Alternating one leg at a time. Woo. In and out. You got it. The terracore should feel pretty comfortable since it curves around your hips. So no pressure on the lower back. Breathe. He's definitely kicking. <laughs> Come on, you're almost there. You get a one minute rest after this before we hit these one more time. Exhale up, inhale down. Finish strong. Woo. Three, two, one, and stop. Awesome. Grab a drink, I'll meet you back here in a minute. Welcome back, we're on a set number two. Staggered squats with those meek twists. So go ahead on the other side, inside foot on, toes forward, other foot's on the floor. Remember, watch your balance with this one. Knee twist is optional. If you're not feeling it, go ahead and keep that foot on the ground. Ready? Let's go. Squat, knee. Plant the foot, squat down again. Good. Stay nice and tall. I know it might take a second to get that balance back, but you've got it. Focus strong. Good, bringing that heart rate back up. Your base leg knee is staying soft, and then you're landing with the soft foot on, on the ground with the other leg. Down and up. Whew. Keep it up, you're working legs, you're working abs. Strong all the way through. Yes. Come on. Three, two, one, and stop. Whew. Walk it out. Donkey jumps are up and overs are coming up next. Feet together jump, or you can stagger it. Okay, <laughs> this way, let's go ahead and place our hands on top of that dome, get into position, take a breath in and out. Three, two, one, let's go. You wanna clear that terracore. Modify, jump, and take your time. If you wanna bring it up more, can you bring your heels all the way up to your glutes? Boom, lift. Still trying to land with soft feet, soft knees. I know these are tough. Stay with it. Just think you're burning so many calories doing these exercises on the terracore with that unsteady surface. Stay there. Breathe. Woo. Come on, three, two, one, and stop. Oh, that one definitely gets the heart rate up fast. All right, reverse crunches. Take a seat, catch your breath for a second. Whew. And when you're ready, hands back on the platform or on top of the dome. Three, two, one, let's go. Both knees or alternating, you choose. Here's your alternating option. That base heel stays on the ground while the other leg comes up. Do what's challenging for you. You got it. You're stronger than you think. So keep it moving. Don't stop. Remember, you get a nice one minute recovery after this. So work for it. Lift, down. This is it, last few. Lift. Fantastic. Three, two, one, and stop. Great job, one minute break. Great job on making it halfway through this workout. You're doing awesome. Here are your exercises for block number three. Kicking it off is staggered up and overs. You're gonna start standing right next to your terracore, inside foot on, we're gonna push up with the heel, and nice and quick go over the top, staying nice and line with the feet. If you need to, you can definitely slow this down and take a little bit longer pause on the bottom end. 
For the second exercise, we're taking it down on top of the terra core and doing some lower body. We're combining a glute press and hamstring curl. So have your hands on top, set your inside knee on top of the terra core, extend your other leg. So even though we're down, we're still focusing on the balance and core stabilization. So keep those abs tight. Bring the leg up, we're gonna curl in, press, down, extend. In, press, up and down. We're gonna stay on the one side for the first set, switch to the other side on the second set. For your third exercise in the third block, we're gonna do a set of crunches. Crunches are great to do on the floor, but they're even better to do on the terracore because you're working on that stabilization. So go ahead and lean all the way back on your terracore so your head, shoulders, and neck are supported. Hands like behind the head, elbows back, engage the core. Inhale, exhale, crunch up and down. And you're lifting high enough to your shoulder blades come off that dome. All right, let's get ready for those staggered up and overs. Start by standing right next to your terra core. Remember, we're gonna be with quick feet, soft knees, going over the top. Take this fast or take it slower, however you like. Okay, get ready. Three, two, one, let's do it. Up and over, up and over. Again, light in the feet, knees are soft. And you get a nice bounce with that dome. So it'll give you an extra lift when you're going over the top. If you need to slow this down, you can definitely hold and pause and then push up. Do what's best for you. So really kicking off this third block with the heart rate going up pretty quickly. Breathe. Yes. Stay there. Almost done. Whew. Last three. Two, one, and stop. Good job. All right, next one, we're taking it down on top, alternating glute press with hamstring curl. So choose a side to begin with. Set the base leg knee on top of the terracore. Hands form around the dome. No pressure in the wrist, and extend the working leg out. Engage the core, lift the leg up, flex the foot. Here we go, curl, press, down, extend. Working the entire posterior chain, glutes, and hamstrings. Abs are tight, staying nice and steady and stable on the terracor, which is a challenge in itself. Good, so staying focused. Breathe. And when you do that glute press, think about pressing that heel up all the way to the ceiling, and then fully extend for that hamstring curl. Good, lift. Remember the side that you're doing now, because we'll get the other side on the second set. Awesome. Three, two, one. Nice and easy, bring that leg down. You can stay low because we're gonna hit crunches next. So take a second, catch your breath. And then when you're ready, we're lying all the way down. Make sure the head, neck, and hips are supported. Hands are light behind the head. Elbows back in your peripheral vision. Engage the core in three, two, one. Let's crunch up and down. Good. So crunches again are great to do on the floor, but even better to do on the terracore because we're working on that unsteady surface. So it should feel pretty good on the back. The dome again curves with your body. So no pressure there. Breathe, exhale, lift, inhale down. Keep your elbows back, look up at the ceiling or sky. You got it. Whew. Lift and down. Your longer break is coming up after this. You've got it. Three, two, one, and stop. Grab a drink. All right, we're rolling right along. Second set of those staggered up and overs. Starting on one side of the terra core. Remember, you're going up and over the top. Go fast, go slow, add a hesitation. Whatever you need to do to get that heart rate up. All right, take one more breath in and out. In three, two, one, let's go. Up and over, up and over. Soft feet, soft knees. Drive through that heel that's on top of the terracore. Let it lift you up a little bit. Good, again, having a little bit less impact doing this on top of the dome. Here it is a little bit slower, so if you need to, hesitate, and then bring it up. Listen to your body, do what's best for you. Woo, press, good. Come on, we're starting to set strong. Breathe. You're almost there. Three, two, one, and stop. Whew. All right, coming up 
other side for those glutes. Glutes and hamstrings. I'm gonna go ahead and do it this side. Hands on top, one knee down. You're gonna extend the one leg out. Again, we do one curl, and then we hit that press right afterwards. Ready, in three, two, one, let's go. Curl, press up, extend out. Core's engaged, watch your balance, breathe. Having a little bit, again, with the arms straight, elbows are soft, so a little bit of upper body work to hold yourself up. Whew. You got it. Lift. Really squeeze that touch on the top end. Stomp up to that ceiling. Full extension with the hamstring curl. Awesome. We're almost there. Whew. Three, two, one. And stop, fantastic. All right, take a breath in and out. We have crunches coming up to complete this third block. So start by taking a seat. Get your body in position. No pressure on the neck, shoulders or back. Hands like behind the head. Engage the core. Three, two, one, let's crunch. Exhale up, inhale down. Lifting high enough till the shoulder blades come off that dome and then nice and slowly lower. Take your time with this. And we're exhale on the lift. Inhale, coming back. Your feet are staying planted the whole time on the ground. Perfect. Lift and down. When you're doing crunches, you're working those breakfast abs when you come up and down. When you engage the core, you're working transverse abs. And breathe. Come on, longer break after this, and then just one final block, and then you're done with this workout. Whew. Three, two, one and stop great job one minute break here are your exercises for block number four we're going to go ahead and move it down onto the ground so if you have a mat go ahead and grab it and place it perpendicular to your terracore kicking it off we're doing a side plank crunch for this one we're going to lean on one side of the terracore elbow and forearm down keeping the inside knee on the ground the whole time abs are tight leg is out arm is up all we're going to do is crunch up driving the elbow towards that knee and then extend and reach. Exhale, crunch, and extend, press out. We're gonna be working those obliques and also a little bit of glutes. For the second exercise in block four, we're gonna assume a high plank position and do elbow to hand planks. With our hands here, you can do this on your toes or your knees. I'll show you both versions. If you're on your toes, we're here, abs are tight. Elbow down, down, up, up. Keeping the core engaged in the back flat. Same body position, knees down, toes up. Elbow, elbow, hand, hand. Wrists are a, ni a nice neutral position on top of that terracore. For the third exercise, let's flip it dome side down with the handles up. We're doing a set of mountain climbers. Now these you can do fast or slow. I'll probably mix mine up throughout the routine, but you're gonna be on your toes. So basic mountain climber, you're driving the knees all the way up to the chest. If you wanna bring this up a notch, you're here. So your goal is to keep that tear cord nice and steady. So abs are tight, back is straight, wrists are nice and straight as well. Okay, let's get into position for those side crunches. Go ahead and rest your forearm down, prop those knees up, extend the outside leg, arm is lifted. Remember, we're crunching nice and tight, working those obliques. Three, two, one, let's do it. Bring it up and extend out. Get a nice stretch on that extension. So your shoulders and elbows are stacked on top of the terracore. No pressure there. You have that nice soft dome surface. And breathing. Exhale, crunch in. Inhale, reach out, extend. So we're going to stay on this side for this set, and then we'll switch sides on the second set. Whew. Exhale, inhale. Breathe. Keep the core engaged. Really tighten up those obliques. Strong with the arms, strong with the leg. Excellent. Three, two, one, and stop. Good, nice and easy. Bring it around. Okay, coming up, we have those plank walks. So we're transitioning from our elbows to hands. You're either on your toes or you're on your knees. I'll show you both throughout the routine. So when you're ready, hands on the terracor, either pop on your toes or your knees, abs are tight, and let's travel. Elbow, elbow, hand, hand. Tummy's tight, back is straight. Take your time. There's a knee version. I drop the knees, toes are up. Elbow, elbow, hand, hand. 
goal is to keep those hips as steady as you can. Breathe. Together from up here. Perfect. These are tough. Take your time, take breaks as you need to. Cool. Keep it up. Definitely working a little bit more upper body here. You got it. Three, two, one, and stop. Shake off those arms for a moment. And then we're gonna go ahead and flip the terracor over. Dome side down, handles up. Mountain climbers, how you like, are next. So do them slow, do them fast, whatever you like. Your goal is to keep that terracor nice and centered on the dome. All right, take a breath, get in position, and let's begin. Here's a slow version. Drive the knee all the way up to the chest. Feeling good, pick it up. So we are finishing heart rate high with these. If you're going fast, keep the wrists in line and breathe. Come on, get those knees up. Woo. And same thing, even if you're doing it slow, focus on still making a big movement with the legs. Knees all the way up to the chest. Yes, stay there, stay there. Woo. Come on, you have a full minute break coming up. So work hard now. Three, two, one, and stop. Great job. You have a one minute rest and recovery. Okay, we're on to set number two. I went ahead and moved my mat to the other side so I can still face you on this side. Let's go into that side plank position with the inside knee down, forearm down, abs are tight. And when you're ready, lift the hip up, extend the leg and arm, and let's crunch. In, extend out. Core's engaged, spine is nice and long. Big crunch, driving that knee all the way up towards the shoulder, elbow down towards the leg. Lift up and down. Stay nice and strong. Try not to let your body lean forward, because if you do, you might keep going all the way down. <laughs> so shoulders pulled back. Got it. This is your final set for each of these exercises. You come this far, let's finish it all up. Woo. Yes, three, two, one, and stop, bring it around. All right, shake out those arms and shoulders. Those plank walks are coming up, so elbow to hand, you're on your toes or your knees. So when you're ready, let's start in that high plank position. Take a breath. Okay, when you're ready, toes or knees up, and let's travel. Elbow, elbow, hand, hand. Abs are tight. Going nice and slow and controlled. If you need to modify, knees down, toes up. Same motion. Press. Definitely getting that bonus shoulder workout here. In addition to the abs. Whew. And definitely more challenging to do it on the terracord with that unsteady surface as opposed to on the floor, flat bench. Breathe. Come on. You're doing awesome. Stay with it. Three, two, one, and stop. Sneak in a quick stretch. All right, this is it. Mountain climbers, do them fast, do them slow. Dome side down, hands on the handles. You've got this. 40 seconds of your life, that is it. That's all I'm asking for. Okay, when you're ready, hands on the handles, high plank, let's go. Do them slow, do them fast. Pick what you like, finish this workout strong. This is it. Whew. Good job, good job. If you get tired, instead of stopping, just slow the pace down a little bit. Catch your breath and then continue on. All the way up. Come on, knees up to the chest. Push. Woo. I know shoulders are feeling this. You got it, you got it. Breathe. Three, two, one, and stop. You did it. Awesome, awesome job. Woo. Nice work today. Congratulations on completing this 30 minute workout. You did awesome. Remember to hydrate throughout the rest of the day and also subscribe to the Terracore channel. I look forward to seeing you next time.